I'm going to try doing a cable cam move now and show you what the difference between the normal yaw and the reverse yaw is. It's actually a pretty cool effect if you, if you need it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into cable cam mode. I'm going to hit the A position. We'll use this as A. Ooh. We'll fly back to the B position. And I'm going to turn it 90 degrees. And I'm going to tilt my camera up to also 90. So we'll make that the B position. And now under normal circumstances, I'm just going to hit the uh, point A. Well, I'm not going to hit it right now because there's somebody standing right next to me. Actually, I am. So as you see, it just did that move the way it normally would. What do you expect? It, it turned back 90 degrees. Now if I go in and hit the options and I hit the reverse yaw along cable and do the same move, here's what happens. It's going to do the opposite 270 degrees and give you a totally different look. Now that's actually really fast, so I'm probably going to slow that down. And we'll come back down to A. We'll do the reverse yaw along A. This is a much slower move. Actually, it's the slowest it'll go. And here I am, kind of. Now I'm going to turn reverse yaw off. and fly back up to the B position. Now we'll just do a nice slow 90 degree move. And if you get up here and you like it, if you want to just change it up there, you can change it, I believe, once it's at its end position. I'm going to turn reverse yaw on. Oh, it moved a little bit on its own. I'm going to fly back down to the A position. Now it'll do the reverse 270. And there we have it. So that's the difference between the normal yaw and the reverse yaw. Gives you a much bigger move in most cases, unless you plan the first move that way. Thanks for watching.